Hello everyone, and welcome back to Tenorshare AI's channel. If you use any of Meta's mobile apps, including Facebook, Instagram, Messenger, or WhatsApp, you may have noticed that Meta AI is already integrated into these apps. This integration is all based on Meta AI's newest large-scale language model, Llama 3. If you don't know about Llama 3 yet, check out the last video on our channel. In today's video we will first share how Meta AI can be integrated into your software, and of course, this video will also teach you how to remove Meta AI if you don't need it. Meta's AI Assistant has actually been around since last year, but recent updates have made it more intuitive in social software. The integration is a little different from app to app. The Facebook app has the most prominent integration with Meta AI. When you search for something, you'll get both Meta AI results and normal search results. If you click on a Meta AI search result, you'll be taken to a chat window with a Meta AI chatbot, and you can even ask Meta AI to write or generate an image. Instagram's integration isn't as much, it will only show up when you click on the search bar. Messenger and WhatsApp have the least integration with Meta AI, with the chatbot basically just being treated as another person in your contacts. Tapping on a conversation with a chatbot to open the Meta AI, and it remembers any questions you've asked it in other Meta-owned apps. Currently, Meta AI is not available for everyone. But what should you do if you have Meta AI on your app and you want to remove it? There is no official way to turn off Meta AI, in short, Meta AI is now mandatory for everyone who update the app. This is really annoying, but I found a way to turn off Meta AI, follow these steps. I will use Facebook as an example. First uninstall Facebook, then we can search Facebook old version in Google. Then download the old version, install it to your phone, then you won't have Meta AI in your app. Do you like using Meta AI in social apps? Let me know what you think in the comments section. So that's it for today's video, don't forget to like and subscribe, see you next time.